I'm starting to run out of save spaces. I'm gonna start have to overwrite on page one again. Uh let's all go to the kitchen. Yes. Can't the family come too? That's four people! You're just gonna let four people stroll on out? Oh my gosh! You're fucking stupid! This is how the next murders are gonna happen! No! No, 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 no! Don't! Oh, no! Oh! Mm, oh! You just fucked up. They're gonna be dead. No! That's literally five people! That's the five remaining people! You idiot! Oh my gosh! They're all going to die. The servants are going to die. There's literally four people in this room, one of which is a little child. You put you took five people away. Oh my gosh. Someone's going to be dead. Oh wait, I haven't thought about this. Can you can sit remember? What I said last time about all the servants being together, how it could also be the command of the father. Well, Beatrice has the same rank as the father. Meaning, someone like Genji would do her bidding to the ends of the earth. Oh my gosh. Right, the servants would have no reason to lock it. If you lock the door, then the person who has a key is the culprit. So then is it not the servants? Unless it's one of the dummy keys that was thrown out and a random culprit found one of those keys. But then they would have to know exactly that that was that specific key. Uh, a 
I just have a really bad suspicion about the servants all leaving at once. All five of them. Remember, eight people have died out of thirteen. Five are needed left. And considering the rest of the people here are Ushiromiya people, just like the last chapter, it does not bode well for them. They're going to die. There's a possibility the grandfather can die too. But, I don't know. Yeah, if, if his key was in her pocket and the room was locked up, then that can only, only, any way you look at it, only way possible is if it was a servant. Wait, now we're putting blame on him again? Oh... No! That makes sense. But then that putting the blame on Cannon. That's, yeah, that's putting the blame on Cannon again. And we know that Cannon's dead because A, we saw it, and B, the witch has said it in red. So this theory is impossible. That could make sense. As long as Beatrice doesn't say the human me wasn't in the room in red or something. But she said that there's no way in or out without the door. There are no hidden doors in the room. There's no way to get in or out other than the door and the windows. 
and the window's locked. So, they're just going to keep on believing that there was a hidden room. So, we already know this is wrong. This is a fool's errand. And you just sent them all out there! Do you realize what you have done? For all you know, four out of the five of them could have been wolves. And you just sent someone to their death. And they're all gonna play innocent. Which is why you don't send all of them out there. Oh, they're gonna be dead. They're so fucking dead. I'm scared of. I'm scared. I feel like we're going to discover their body. Right. Everyone, go! None of this splitting up bullshit based upon servant or fucking family. Then the father would be dead. Your dad would be dead. If they were both wolves, then that would mean Kinzo's dead, but you have spoken to Kinzo yourself. They would have killed the head if they had the chance. He's the one who has the money. It's all fucked. All of it. You have a lot in common with your fucking sister-in-law. Genji and Shijinen can't be the culprits. In the human theory at all. You wanna know why? Because they were with Kenzo. Kenzo's alive. Which means they can't be evil. Yeah, that's not funny. That's... That's fucking scary.
Yeah, I'm sure that would fucking work. Yeah, and one more is about to happen. They're gonna be gone for a long time. We're gonna go into the kitchen. One of them's gonna be stabbed in the fucking head. Uh, there was like knee, chest, head, whatever. You fucked up. There, someone's going to die. Someone's going to die. Yes, and you let them all leave at once and didn't fucking follow them? What happened to staying together? Besides, if all of the servants were wolves, well then you'd all be fucked because there's four of you, five of them. Even with that gun, holy shit. It's a lot of people. Yeah, where the fuck is human Beatrice? No, trust me, there is. Oh, is she really gonna do that? <laughs> okay. Alright. Alright, Beto, that was that was funny. I'll have to admit that. I'm just afraid that the third twilight will happen at any point. I just, I feel like one of these people are going to die. I, I feel, honestly, if you ask me, I feel like Shannon's going to die. Something tells me that Shannon's going to die and it's going to tear George up. And more suspicion on the others are going to arise because of it. And he's going to join Rose's side. Well, here's the thing. I don't think the witch has poisoned the food. 
You want to know why? Because that would go against the epitaph. If she killed everyone here... Oh shit, wait, she would have enough people then. Because A, there's the human guest herself, and B, there's Kinzo on top of the four people in the parlor. Yeah, no, I don't feel relaxed. I feel like someone's going to die. What the fuck's gonna happen? to continue this next time. Yeah, who the fuck could it be? I knew leaving the parlor was a bad idea, so until then, guys, until then, holy shit, I'll see you then.